help four dysfunctionals. Hey, this was your mother's idea. Well, I guess it beats yoga. Huh? Now he beats yoga. <laughs> Literally. Like Fabian? Around the head with a laptop? Oh, yeah, like, pow! Our old man released the dude's inner tranquility all over the bean machine bat. To be honest, and I know it's karmically bad, but yeah, I fucking hate that dude. Yeah, I know, right? He's so up his own ass. You're a fucking contortionist. Whoopee. I contort my junk all day long, and I don't act all superior about it. Just a little ashamed and empty inside. Overshare. Hey, guy was talking smack to your mother. Well, I applaud you, Pop. Here, here. You're like finally like using your powers of selfishness and rage for like good. Not an objective universal good, but like a subjective what's in our best interest kind of good. Fuck yeah, awesome. Let's rob somebody. Ha. Do it, Dad. Yeah, do, do it. it. Do, do it. it. Enough, okay? I love that we're getting along, but knock it off. Yeah, don't like actually rob a liquor store. That might like kill the mood. Fucking therapy. Let's do that shit. Hey, how about you just let your mom and me talk, okay? We got some issues we gotta iron out. And seeing as you two aren't into it, you can just sit there and be quiet. That's cool with me. I got all the prescriptions I need, at, at least for the meantime. Thank you. Michael, kids, let's go inside. Okay. I'm fighting. Amanda! Hello! Good to see you again, Michael. I'm so glad. Isn't this great? Fantastic. Michael, be positive. I am being positive. <clears throat> this is me being positive. Give it up, Michael. The sarcasm. It's one of the reasons I moved out. It's beneath you. No, it's not, Amanda. Trust me. Nothing's beneath me. No, normally there's a whore beneath you. <laughs> you know, for someone who spends every waking moment working on themselves inside and out, I gotta tell you, the progress has been really fucking slow. How would you know what progress is like, you stupid murdering shit? Uh, gee, because all you do is whine at me. Oh! All I do is whine. Michael, could you please stop murdering people? Michael, could you please stop endangering me and the both of your children? You kill people and then you sit in the sun and drink and feel guilty about it. That is not work. I don't see you complaining on the way to the fucking bank. I mean, let's face it, Amanda. We're trailer trash, you and me. We were taught to do this. Get a center, Michael. You have no center. How about you suck my cock? Huh? No, wait. We'll both get a center before that ever happens. You are such a fucking animal, a deranged animal. You're fucking ain't right on deranged. How could I not be? I should have had you locked up years ago, you stupid Do it. shit. Do it. I'll put you in the fucking ground with the rest of them. And that's really all the time we have. Oh. Great. I think we made some real progress there. Oh, uh, Michael. <laughs> I hope this goes without saying, but family work is a little more expensive. What, double? Squared. <laughs> of course. Take care now. Hey, so are you gonna come home with me or what? I guess we'll give it a try. All right then. Kids! Are you gonna take us home then? You know, there was a moment there, I thought... What? I don't know, like, maybe we still had a ways to go. You know, like, maybe we need more time. Time for what? 
Time to move beyond screaming at each other. That was cathartic. Catharsis all over my face. Ooh, I got a warm, fuzzy feeling. Probably just the meds you raided. Okay. Cathartic. All right. I just don't want it to be more of the same. Now you're the one making the demands? No, 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 not demands. I, I, I'm saying you're right. Something was broke, and we gotta work at fixing it. We do. All of us. Yes, Mom. For real, peeps. Because I started to understand something in there. No one else gets this family. Not Dr. Friedlander, or my yoga teacher, or our tennis coach, or the juice guy, or the dog walker. Or... Oh, hey, hey. Or Jimmy's third grade teacher. Or the trash guy. Or dad's proctologist. Or the guy that thinks he's Jesus on Vespucci Beach. Or the hippie bum who thinks the world is ending. We're stuck with each other. I mean, how do you explain faking our deaths, changing our names, all the lying to the FIB? That monster, Trevor? There's no... Screw you! No explaining, Uncle T. Hey, is he coming to the next therapy session? What? No... No! Jeez! Kids, rooms. If you find dead bodies, cheap women, or Trevor Phillips, we're checking into the Rockford Hills Hotel. Yeah, hello. 
Who is this? It's me. I shouldn't have called. P Patricia! Mrs. Madrazo! Hey! Are you behaving, Trevor? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Patricia, I really miss you. A time together. It was, it was very important. I, I have to go. Patricia! Mrs. Madrazo! Trevor! Oh, I miss you. All you boys. Miss you too. I, c I can't speak for the other... boys. You're such good friends. Uh, it's a bit more complicated than that. Actually, Michael and I... Yeah, not speaking. Old friendships cannot be replaced. Hey, how are you? Is Martin looking after you? He's here. I've got to go. Trunk of this thing.
Woo! Venison steaks all around. 